This video will show you how to set up a macro using Razer Synapse. For this, you will need a Razer peripheral. Start by opening the Razer Synapse app. If you don't have it, a link will be provided in the description. Open the macro setting under the modules heading. Create a new macro by pressing the plus icon in the macro list panel. Now, you can choose to manually insert actions or record your macro. Recording your macro is the fastest and easiest option, and you can always modify the script later. For this example, I will be creating a script that will open OBS and turn on Replay Buffer. I will be using Control shift t to launch the program, and Control shift l to start Replay Buffer. A tutorial for setting these hotkeys will be linked below. Click the down arrow next to the record button and assign a shortcut key. This key will start and stop your macro recording process. Here you can also choose your delay options and whether or not to record your mouse movements. Press your recording shortcut and wait for the countdown to finish. Then record your macro. When you have finished recording your macro, you can use the recording hotkey to finish. Delete any unwanted actions by selecting it and pressing the trash can. You will notice two inputs for each key, a press and a release. On the left side, you will also see the delay between current and previous action. You can select any event and change the keystroke, delay, or action under the Properties tab. Altering the delay is useful for speeding up actions that are instant. Lowering it can give you an advantage while gaming. You can also insert actions to add more functionality to your script. If you need to undo or redo a change, you can use the curved arrow above the script. Click on the macro name to change it. Press the tick to confirm. Now we need to assign the macro to a key. Click the plus in the key bind section. Choose the device you want to bind the macro to. I will be using my keyboard. Select the key you want to remap. Choose your playback option, then save. You can now play the action using this key. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, please be sure to drop a like and comment. Also, be sure to subscribe for more helpful tech videos. It really helps support the channel.